Hello, darkness, my old friend. Where am I? Have you ever wanted to walk through a door and appear on the other side of the world? Masen Hamid uses this plot device in Exit West to explore the current refugee crisis. In an unknown Middle Eastern country, the book opens with Saeed and Nadia, two college students, meeting each other. As their relationship blossoms, the country around them crumbles from civil war, and they are forced to flee through magical doors that connect places around the world. Exit West has a fictitious aspect similar to the Chronicles of Narnia. However, the serious nature of the story is reminiscent of A Thousand Splendid Sons. While the migration is often the most treacherous part of a refugee story, Hamid removes it with his usage of magic doors to focus on the effect of refugees on the countries they arrive in. He paints a hopeful future for refugees, as countries like England steadily, yet not so smoothly, integrate the refugees as part of their populations. A major theme in the novel is the concept of family and home. While Nadia's independence and lack of connection to her family allow her to escape her homeland without much emotional attachment, Saeed is deeply affected by his decision to leave his father and home. To combat the stress, Saeed turns to religion, specifically praying more and more each day. However, the idea of home is treated very differently by the natives of countries that the refugees are fleeing to. A common reaction to the influx of migrants, both in the story and real life, is to reject them as creatures undeserving of their nation's wealth and resources. Hamid responds to this in his description of refugees. In these trees, there were now dark bodies too, children who climb like monkeys, not because to be dark is to be monkey-like, but because people are monkeys who have forgotten that they are monkeys, losing respect for the natural world. Not only are we animals, but we are all refugees. Through a minor story in the novel, Hamid portrays a woman who grew old in a town that was changing around her. She becomes a refugee in time, feeling out of place compared to the new inhabitants. The author subtly argues that we should all feel for refugees, since at some point in our lives we become one. Anyone interested at all in the refugee crisis should read this book. The plot somewhat weakens as the novel trudges towards its end, but it is worth the read to get a unique individual perspective on refugees. Also, the evolution of Saeed and Nadia's relationship might interest anyone who is into romance novels. Overall, I would rate this book three and a half stars out of five. That was my review of Exit West by Masan Hamid. If you like this video, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe and comment down below for any further book reviews that you're interested in.